My name's Joshua Yu, and this is my last lecture. It's going to be a knockout. Chapter 1. An injured lion still wants to roar. If I was to compare myself to an animal, it would be a lion. A lion has a lot of pride and always takes care of its family. Just like a lion, I try my best to take care of my family and keep them safe. Also, I take a lot of pride in everything I do and make sure that Chapter I give my all, all even though it's not a lottery. My dad was never into studying, but once he got older, he stopped causing trouble and started trying on everything he did. My dad was always here for me, and he always does his best my to try and make My mom moved me. from Korea at the age of 17 alone. She moved here alone because her parents decided to stay in Korea. Ever since then, my mom tried hard in school and work. She always tried supplying the best for me and it keeps me in check. Chapter 7. I never made it to the NFL. I've been playing soccer ever since I was little because my mom forced me to. Soccer has taught me how to work hard and keep trying when you don't succeed. I've made new friends because of soccer and soccer helped me get rid of my stress and get away from my problems. Chapter 11. The Happiest Place on Earth Snowboarding helped me clear my mind. The adrenaline I get from going off ramps, jumping onto rails, gives me a feeling that I can't get anywhere else. It gives me joy and happiness. The beach helps me think and relax when times are tough. Chapter 21, J. I have known Robbie for four years. Robbie pushes me to do my best in school and soccer. He also makes me a better person. He tries to keep me away from trouble, but I still have a good time with him. Alvin is my older brother. He is 18 and he supports me in everything. I need, If I need help, he is there. He left the house, but that didn't stop him from looking out for me. He would always still give me rides and take me out to eat and be the same big brother. Chapter 24 A Recovering Jerk A lot of times I felt anger and frustration, but from those times I've learned to make smarter choices and learn how to think positive. I learned to see things in the best way, even though things are going wrong. At 17, I wanted everything that was in store. At 23, I bought it all just to make sure. Chapter 28, Dream Big. My goal is to be a professional soccer player. And to do this, I need to constantly work hard and practice. If you want to reach your goal, you need to be dedicated to it and work hard every day to get better. Oh, shit. Chapter 53. Never give up. I was always told I would not get to my goals by my family and friends because my goals were too hard. Even when it gets hard, I push through and accomplish my goals because I think that if you try hard enough and put your mind to it, you will succeed. Chapter 56. Make a decision. Tigger or Eeyore? I am a Tigger. Ever since I was little, I have been causing trouble. I don't think about the amount of trouble that I cause until after. At times I can be an Eeyore, but I don't like to be negative because if you're negative, you'll never see the fun thing. Oh, bro. Chapter 61 The Dream Will Come to You. My dream is to be a professional soccer player, but there are always obstacles in my way. School is one of them. I hate reading the books that Mr. Marco gives us because they are boring. In life, there's always right and wrong. I try choosing right because it might help me reach my dreams and influence others to do the same. Thoughts and Reflections Think positive, always have fun, and be nice to others.